What's going on? I am Ghost Boy Colby. This is my first video for this channel, and uh, I figured that for my first video, or at least my first gaming video, I would do the first game in one of my favorite game series, and that is Bioshock. Now, Bioshock 1 I think is a great game. I've played it before, so I won't be surprised by the plot details and whatnot but honestly if you haven't played Bioshock by now and it's 2020 and this game came out in like 2007 that's pretty surprising so you know personally I won't be surprised by the plot details but I'll try to keep spoilers out as I'm playing best as I can my personal favorite entry in the series is Bioshock 2 that's for my own personal reasons I know not everybody feels the same way but uh, I think that my plan is to play through one, see how well that does. Whether or not it does that well, if I even beat it on the channel, I'm still going to move on to Bioshock 2. And then uh, just because I don't want to play stuff out of order, I'm going to do uh, the Bioshock 2 DLC which would be Minerva's Den in particular. I might do Protector Trials, we'll see. Uh, but then after that, I'm going to do Bioshock Infinite and the Bioshock Infinite DLCs. Uh, that would be that would be Burial at Sea Parts 1 and 2. So we'll see if we get to that point, but for now we're starting with Bioshock 1. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, let's see gonna set the brightness. I don't I don't want it too uh, Dark just for my own reasons and also because I'm recording on YouTube, so I'm gonna set the brightness a little higher than You know you might Expect so if it's a little too bright. I'm sorry uh, In the next episode I can change it if I need to but for now I'm just gonna leave it like this or maybe something like that gonna go with medium because I have played this game before but no promises that I'm not gonna die because it's really rare for me to go through Bioshock any of the Bioshocks without dying at least once so I'm not saying it's gonna be a super common occurrence but it's probably gonna happen I'm just saying is all I'll try not to cut uh, talk during the cutscenes They told me. I forgot to turn on some titles. I'm sorry. You're special. You were born to, off to great a great things. start. You know what? They were right. I'm not playing the remastered version, by the way. This is the original, because my computer sadly can't run the remastered versions of Bioshock 1 and 2. I don't know why. Even with the lowest graphic settings, I've, I've tried. It just does not work. But yeah, like I said, uh, I forgot to turn on subtitles, so as soon as I can hit start so that I can pause, I'm going to turn on subtitles. Sorry about that. And uh, I, make no, I make no promises that this is going to run 100% smoothly. Um, let's see. What would it be under? Art subtitles. Oh no, I do have subtitles on. I didn't see them. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll worry about that later. But yeah, my computer is not a gaming PC. So this probably isn't going to run 100% smoothly. Okay, so our plane crashed. 
Uh, it seems like the only place to go to is this big tower. So I guess this is where we're gonna go into. Can't see. No gods or kings, only man. When I look at it, the subtitle is propaganda, so I guess that's some propaganda. I'm just guessing, you know. Oh, that's uh, somewhere under the sea or, or something like that. I know it's a older song. This is set in what, the 50s? Yeah, I want to say this is set in the mid 50s or maybe late 50s. Okay, more propaganda. This time it's in video. Fire at your fingertips. I am Andrew Ryan, and I'm here to ask you a question. Well, half ass in video. The sweat of his brow. No, wow, the production the quality is insane. Belongs to the poor. No, Wonder what the budget the was. The Vatican, it belongs to God. No, says the man in Moscow. It belongs to everyone. I rejected those answers. Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. I chose rapture. I can't whistle. I'm sorry. Where the scientists would not be bound. Did I say whistle? I meant whistle. Sorry. It's hard to hear myself because the game audio is very loud. Can become your city. I've got a lot of things to say about Andrew Ryan's character, but I'm gonna save that for much later, because like I said, I'm trying to keep spoilers out. All good things of this earth flow into the city. Okay, if you say so. All right, so looks like we're going into the city. Welcome to Rapture, up to a uh, Kashmir restaurant. Okay, save your game at any time from the options menu. All right, and uh, it's displaying for an Xbox 360 controller, but I'm using an Xbox One controller, so just keep that in mind. It's not that important, so I don't really know why I brought it up, but uh, I thought I should mention it. Just because. Audio is a little bit off, I'm sorry. I don't know why that is. Is it someone new? Me too. Sounds of exertion. That is exactly what I would name a slam band if I had one. I'm just saying. Sounds of exertion? That is the perfect band name. She is trying really hard to get in here. I don't know what I did to piss her off besides just breathe. 
Back off, lady. Wait, where'd she go? I said back off, and she took it a little too literally. Atlas. Okay, where? Take a deep breath and step out of the bathosphere. I won't leave you twisting in the wind. Where is he? We're gonna need to draw out of hiding, but you're gonna have to trust me. Where are you, Atlas? Why should I even trust you? I guess it's my only option. Excuse me? Huh? Wait, are you gonna coddle me to sleep? Swaddle? Coddle? I don't know. Get her! Shooty shooty bang bang! Shoot her dead! Uh, I'm looking. Ah, will a wrench do? I know you said crowbar, but beggars can't be choosers, I'm thinking. Okay. So... That's on fire. Obviously, but I'm just... Ah! Who did that? What? Huh? Excuse me? Hey, what? Leave me alone. Back off. Get. Yeah. What the? <laughs> His pipe did a little jig. Okay, where's that coming from? Ooh, stairs. Probably coming up the stairs. That's really loud, ain't it? Ooh. So we got Eve hypos and the images are syringes. Are we doing drugs? Okay, looks like we're doing drugs. <laughs> Jinkies. Your genetic code is being rewritten. Just hold on and everything will be Boy, better pull yourself together. Weak. First timers, am I right? This little fish looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he's still got the madam on. Speaking of first timers, <laughs> I swear I didn't remember that line. It was just really fitting. He's probably right. Huh. Nice guys. Nice guys. That's a big foot. And a drill. It's a good thing he didn't step on my head because I would have surely died. <laughs> Snap! Crack. Coming from his belly. Wait a minute. He's still breathing. That's not normal. Take me it's to a doctor. Right. I know he'll be an angel soon. Wait, hold on. What was that you said about light coming from my belly? That's not supposed to happen. Get back here. I have questions. You all right, boy? First time plasma the real kick from a mule. But there's nothing like a fist full of lightning now, is Yeah, I figured that out the hard way. Uh, okay, so is there anything else around here? I don't see anything. Uh, one man's vision, mankind's station, or mankind's salvation. God, I can't read. Uh huh, so that's like a little miniature of what? The original plan for rapture or something? Like original blueprint, maybe? Uh, boom. Whoa. Can't walk. 
Ah. Oh. All right, who's bombing Rapture? Jesus, Iran, is that you? Well, I guess this is back in the 50s, so it's not World War III quite yet. In another universe, maybe, but <laughs> I feel like the 50s are a little too soon for World War III. Where is he? Oh. Aha! Be gone. That's what you get for trying to sneak up on me. You almost succeeded. <sighs> but that's what you get for trying. Oh, I shouldn't have taken those. Okay, so, cigarettes. All I uh. Someone, but this fucking place is poison. I'm trying to talk here. Uh, cigarettes. Oh. Drain your health, but they give you Eve. And you need Eve to be able to. Uh, use the plasmids, which are the powers that you have in your left hand. You don't need anything to use the wrench. It doesn't take any ammo, it never breaks, nothing like that. But we will get weapons later on that take ammo, and once we're out of ammo, we're just screwed until we find some more. But just like with the first aid kits and the EVE hypos, we can find them you know, we can find ammo just about anywhere. But keep in mind that stuff you find on the ground is limited. It's always, they're always going to be the same items, no matter how many times you play the game. And once they're gone, you're going to have to buy more. We'll get money, and we'll find vending machines and shit. So, sorry, I'm trying not to talk. But you're the only hope I'll ever see my wife and child again. Go to Neptune's bounty. Find my family, please. Sorry, I know I said I wouldn't talk over cutscenes, but I thought that was important to mention. And I don't count it as spoilers because it's just simple gameplay mechanics. Mommy's gone. Ugh. Yeah, mommy's gone. Ooh, give me that. I don't know why you were talking to it like it was a goddamn baby, but I'll definitely take it. In fact, I don't think I- oh. Shouldn't have did that. Oh, 1959. Is that the year it is? Hmm. What was that? You want this ugly? What do you want this nice? I can do it either way. Open the damn door! Well, somebody's downstairs. Oh, I was running straight into a Last pillar. Let me load. Aha, gotcha. Okay, so for the early game, I'm gonna try to use the wrench as much as possible just to save some ammo. Uh, no promises, it'll be amazingly effective, but I'm still gonna try. Uh, okay, and when I search around to loot stuff, I'm really thorough, so if I take too much time looking around for stuff, I'm sorry. That's this is just how I've always played the game. Uh, if I see booze or cigarettes, I'm going to try my best not to pick them up. And they're fried. Um, when it comes to items like cigarettes and uh, alcohol, 
they have a positive effect, but they also have a negative effect. So, in my opinion, I think it's best just to not even pick pick them up because things like health bars and and stuff like that are better because they don't have negative effects. Another New Year's, another night alone. I'm out and you're stuck in Festus working. Huh. Imagine. Another drink. <laughs> Here's a toast to Diane McClintock. Silliest girl in Rapture. Silly enough to fall in love with Andrew Ryan. <laughs> Silly So, that's not the last we'll hear from Diane. Uh, her story is pretty sad. Uh, I'll try and find all of the, uh, the audio logs that I can, but I don't think I've ever gotten all of them before, so. I'm not trying to flush the toilet. Quit it. Why don't you fix it yourself? I come from Texas, where we say, do what you damn self. Careful now. Would you kindly lower that weapon for a minute? Well, maybe I don't wanna. What, do you want me to not protect myself? You think that's if you can't tell, this place there. is pretty dangerous. Don't be fooled. She's a little sister now. Somebody went and turned a sweet baby girl into a monster. Whatever you thought about right and wrong on the surface, well, that don't count for much down in Rapture. Those little sisters, they carry Adam, the genetic material that keeps the wheels of Rapture turning. Everybody wants us, everybody needs us. I mean, it looks like a little girl to me, but that definitely sounds like a demon voice, so... Potentially a future E-girl. I don't know. Oh, there he is. There's Mr. Bubbles. Ah. Boy, you're screwed. I hate to tell you. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but you're not in for a good time. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, uh, I told you. Hi, Mr. Bubbles. How you doing? Don't kill me. I'm gonna kill you later though, I'm just saying. And uh, that was a glitchy little sister right there. Uh, you know what? I think with that, I'm gonna leave off. Um, I'm gonna try to keep my episodes relatively short, that way they're not too much hassle to upload. Uh, either way, it's still going to take quite a while, but uh, yeah, so I hope y'all uh, <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed watching uh, my commentary. I don't know. I, I don't know how it is. I'm just going to leave that for y'all to decide, but uh, until the next video, peace. I'll try to get this uploaded as soon as I can. Uh, see ya.